Guardians yeah, man. of the Galaxy. This, this has got a lit soundtrack. You, I, you, I could have chose to have it in streamer mode, so I could have uploaded it to YouTube. Or you don't not. know I was a like, lot about I'm not going to miss out on the music they've chosen for this. No fucking way. There was someone. Oh, yeah. Rocket story, man. So sad. She's gone now, but maybe with that relic, I can make her ungone. He can't. He tried it. <laughs> I know you've got a lot on your mind, but that kid you fought, maybe he does too. You would prick should stay away, didn't Promise me in the future you'll use your words instead of oh, your fists. Oh, I did promise her too. I will, Mom. Bollocks. I promise. But that wasn't a real memory. That was a fake memory where Thank you, baby. we realize it. The Eternity Forge resides here, pending such Eternity time Forge was it. <laughs> as it can be wielded responsibly. Until then, she shall remain entombed across the galaxy. Come find me, Peter. I'll be waiting for you. Okay. Game series adapts to the choices you make. The story is tailored by how you play. It really is such a shame that the studio went down, man. I love these games. You're nearly there, Peter. Massive shame we won't get like the Wolf Among Us 2 and stuff as well. Game of Thrones season 2. I bet that would have been sick. I hope some company does a like dirty move and just copies their idea. <laughs> I hope some other company just picks it up. Maybe even just hires them. Dire Warrior 4. I got it, Mom. Thanks, baby. Ugh. Another headache? Just a little one. She should drink more Stop water. Stop worrying. It's fine. Just took me by surprise. I wish I could help. I know you do. Some things, Peter. They're not yours to control. I better get that prescription before the pharmacy closes. Yeah. Stay out of trouble till I get back, okay? Yeah. Be good. I know that's <laughs> not always easy for you. Aww. Where's the fun in that? Being good can be fun too. <laughs> Give me one example. Yeah, go. I'll get back to you on that. <laughs> I'll be back soon. Hey, Pete. Hey, Mr. Pinkle. Hey, Mr. Man. Here to get that mixtape copied? Yeah. Sure is a nice thing to do for your mom. You seriously? How's she Man. doing anyway? Just buying do tape to tape she's fine well glad to hear it both sides come back in yeah. about an hour and it'll be ready can't look at life from hey, one side Petey. now can you oh no the bully you make that mix for your boyfriend Barry Bullison <laughs> Clarence I made it for your mom watch Get him it, or you'll be swallowing <laughs> your own teeth Clarence. Unless you're Christian Slater playing afraid Clarence on your break it again? You're having it off. You afraid with I'm gonna Rocket. hit you again? Oh, <laughs> you. Pretending you got balls! Hey! How's that lip doing? Not too bad. Gimme that. What are you doing here anyway? You don't have money. Alright. Everyone in town's talking about it. Your mom can't even pay her medical bills. Savage. She's been going door to door asking for help, like some pathetic loser. She's wow, probably dude. off looking for change in the sewers right now. Come on. Let's not do this, man. Do what? We're just talking. You gonna cry now? Use you your done words. yet? Elephant ears? We you promised must get our mother. Great we reception her. with those things. <laughs> no, nah, I'm not done. You didn't even take the braces, but you went straight for the ears. She sure is. My dad goes drinking with her doctor. Told him everything. Patient confidentiality. Guess she didn't feel like we can it was sue. Enough to tell we'll be living you. it good, man. We'll be living it good. We'll be up to four those in no time. Check it out. Dead woman walking. Wow. 
Now can I punch him? What's the point? Drugs ain't gonna help. My dad says you're gonna die anyway. Where'd you get those bruises, huh? Your dad? Or does your mom have a good swing too? I'm gonna go to your <laughs> funeral just to see your son cry. This is savage little shit, man. <laughs> get him. <laughs> get out. My dad's gonna- Out! Sounds kind of like Finn the human. No, oh, I guess you mean just verbally, not you as in because Finn's really nice. I was gonna, but Finn never says horrible things. <laughs> I'm proud of you, Peter. Even though I didn't set a very good example, the things he said. Yeah, he's a little shit. I let my emotions get the better of me. You slapped him. That was awesome. Yeah, no, that <laughs> I liked it. Actually, beat his ass too. Not awesome, Peter. <laughs> Meaning Peter. Okay, yeah, I could dig that. Yeah. You were dying, Mom. Yeah, I can kind of hear that. To be fair. Is that true? Yeah. Yeah. Find me, please. Yeah. You're so close, Peter. All right. Scary eyes. <laughs> what the? That's what puberty is. Zero, my boy! How are you doing today, dude? I want to fizzle in a different place. Oi, oi. <laughs> well, you never know, man. If you turn out to be one of the dragons in disguise, you may you may get more than what you've asked for. <laughs> but how are you doing today, dude? Lovely to see you. <laughs> We're just getting started on episode three of Marvel's Telltale's The Walking Dead's Guardians of the Galaxy AMC. It's really good. <laughs> mm. And that was well, fucking A. <laughs> how you doing, dude? Everybody's in the party. <laughs> just made that song up. Yeah. No good, just woke up, getting ready for work. Nice. Sounds good, dude. Sounds good. <laughs> well, what's on your agenda for today at work? Are you, um. You carrying on working on the game at all? She gone cray cray. Hey. <laughs> I'm just gonna see what happens. Mora? Are you okay? This temple is really messing with my head. Hello, Gamora. Hello. Ah! Oh, Ooh. hey, Gamora. Come on, what? Nebula. what are you doing? You can do better than that. Oh. Back off, Gamora. Seriously. Stop it! Slow, slow. Ah! Okay, Come no on, stop wind. Oh, dude. Fair. I hope. Oh, shit. So I'm just trying not to get sliced by her. <laughs> hope everything's going okay. I know you said you're probably gonna like have like a procedure of sorts, I guess. Um, do you know like when that is? And we playing see if he's has. <laughs> Focus, Nebula. Oh, they're kids. You need to be aware of everything around you. Perception's just as important as strength and speed. None of them are important when I'm stuck here. I want to use what you've taught me somewhere outside of this room. Mm. I'm sick nice. of just doing the same thing dude. over and over, <laughs> every single day. Be patient, Nebula. You'll get your chance soon enough. So now I need patience too. If you want to be a doctor, you do. Oh. 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 Right. <laughs> So bad. Looks like, like you've lost your touch. <laughs> <laughs> Hardly. <laughs> Bets on what button comes up next. Right. What well, he had right again. Damn. And then X. That's a bit of a B. B B. Finish her. A little impressive. <laughs> Just a little. I can't. Gamora, you're hurting me. Get fucking stronger. Fuck it, I'm beating her. I'm not letting her win. That's not how you get stronger. <laughs> so, uh, two of us took a skull fort on your own, managed to catch it in just as ship came to attack us. Father. So we lured them into another fight with another galleon who helped us sink them. Fucking hey, that one ain't his guy chasing you. Oh. <laughs> That still sounds like a fucking cool night, though. Nebula, <laughs> you have grown so much. 
Father. You may yet be the greatest assassin in the galaxy. Don't you agree, Gamora? <laughs> I do. She's come a long way. What a pleasant surprise. Yeah, been a good sister. Perhaps being bested by your sister recalled the importance of humility. I have a mission for you. You will go to a Kree outpost on the planet of Phalion. There you will find General Tarval. He has come into possession of something I require. A device. I is it time to Gamora, go? you will fetch the device for me. So he you, ran there and he managed Nebula. to kill them like three or four times while you preparing your ship down. The general. Took four of them like ten minutes Thank to sink you. a ship. Jeez. So you know that well, it sounds like it. I will succeed. <laughs> I know you will, daughter. Gamora. You were always my favorite. But you have become cold, distant. We will not disappoint you. Oh, Thanos, several major attacks. But you already have, Gamora. Oh. Otherwise, you would not be taking Nebula with you. Savage. Go and prepare. You will head out immediately. To him a pirate, I'd be Gamora, fucking hell, man. <laughs> I know you no longer care. <laughs> but if you fail, your sister will pay for your missteps. Tell Nebula I wish to speak with her. You tell her. I'm going, I'll let you quest. You and Hotch are becoming good pirates, nice, nice. <laughs> Is everything alright? What's going on? My trial must be running out, I really need to double check that it hasn't just like carried on paying about my hear you, mission. But Father, he didn't look happy. Thanos wants to talk to you. To me? Yeah. Yeah. You're his like stolen daughter. But I think in the comics she's the granddaughter. Or is it in the film she's the granddaughter? <laughs> Cree outpost. I'm fairly in. Sneaky, sneaky. This is Let's it. go. My chance to prove myself. Can I help in the shower? No worries, Zero. We'll see you soon, dude. You have a, a beautiful rinse, man. Don't worry, Nebula. You can I've got you You're going to donate no. a bit of money to you for Sophia Fees. Oh, I've cheers, got to do this I mean, like I said, I will keep, I'll keep it's an eye out for it sale wise for. as well. I hope you'll find it I at a good price. But cheers, dude. <laughs> I will try and see what I can do, too. <laughs> Let's just do this. Okay. I don't know what we're doing, I wasn't listening. Thinking about pirates. <laughs> These are all are like space pirates. So wait, even if you have to buy from Microsoft Store, you won't be paying full price. That's true, that's true. I appreciate that, as of most of you. <laughs> but yeah, I know you said you found a key cheaper, so we'll keep an eye out. You never know, might get lucky. <laughs> Ooh, excuse me. X. Gonna give it to you. Why? Because he wants to. Hello. There you are. Oh, Nebs. Just slicing and dicing and screaming and reaming. Yeah, I didn't see. <laughs> Murder one. Yeah. <laughs> I think it was due to our summer evening. Okay, yeah. I know like CD keys and stuff, she's pretty safe, so Nebula, are you I'll keep an eye on it there as well. Are you hurt? <laughs> Why? Why did you do that? What? I had him. That was my kill and you took it from me. You definitely did not have him there. My father will be so upset with me. Tarval was about to kill you, Nebula. 
I just saved your life. I know you want to impress Thanos, but trust me, he is not worth dying over. Father. Mm. This, I mean, if she's gonna act this way on missions, me the device. I'm, I'm not gonna Nebula, be nice. What are you doing? You took my kill. Give me the device in exchange. Fuck off. Give it to me now. I'm not asking here. I'm no, not that's giving. not how this works. I don't take orders from you. Then you leave me no choice. Oh, what bitch, are you... what are you gonna do? <gasps> she stabbed me in the fucking back. <sighs> Holy shit. Lembler's a pretty bad sister. She's not the best. Oh no, I bet Gamora dies and never has any more story after this ever. Such a shame. I bet Gunn Chu made a really good character. Oh. This is just like a simulation that Nebula just fucked up. <laughs> oh crap. Oh, yep, she thinks I'm never there. <laughs> you slapped me. <laughs> that I was trying to snap you out of it before you killed me. <laughs> well, that's not the way to do it. Well, apparently it was. <laughs> Stop. Stop slapping me. <laughs> Stop it. <laughs> Okay, I'll, I'll call. I'll call. Oh, let's keep going. <laughs> don't do that again. I don't know what happened. One minute you and I were walking into the temple, and the next yeah, I was. Yeah, I, uh, I know. Wait, were you. Did you see all that? Every bit. My memory? Mm hmm. Are you okay? I've been trying not to think of that day because I really want to fix things with Nebula. But seeing that... She thought I was being selfish, taking away everything she worked so hard to achieve. That's why she turned on me. I saw what happened. You were just trying to protect her. You can't blame yourself for that. She kind of I'm will. not so sure. That last moment, it became everything. All I remembered of her. But Just forget about it. There were times we were happy. Yeah. Despite Thanos, despite everything. There's moments we, we weren't each fighting. Other. Maybe, maybe I could have done more. No, Been you, more you rest your yellow panda eyes. Stop just seeing her as someone I needed to protect. You can't change the past, Gamora. She is who she is. That's exactly it, Peter. Nebula is who she is because of me. That oh, nice. hatred, that coldness, yeah. her inability to trust anyone. She's she her own independent girl, yeah. Thanos's daughter. Who else could she be after I betrayed her? Failed her. Blue Man Group. She could probably do well in the Blue Man Group. Listen to me. You didn't fail her. You don't fail at anything. You are the strongest person I know, okay? Uh -huh. And I respect the hell out of you for that. And I don't just mean the ass kicking. I mean, believe me, you kick some serious ass. I do kick a lot of ass, huh? Hell yeah, you do. Now, come on. Let's figure out why the Forge brought us here before things get even more... Weird. <laughs> Weird. Oh, man. They really only did have a couple of songs My for this, didn't they? My mom loved this song. She played that record non-stop. Peter, wait. This place... It seems to be using our memories against us. 
We don't know what we'll find inside. Or why it's been drawing us here. This is chains. Don't worry, okay? I can handle whatever happens. I promise. I've heard that before. Oh, come on. That time I died? That totally doesn't count. Lead on that, <laughs> but carefully. I mean, he was stabbed in the chest. She was stabbed in the back. It's just part of being a space pirate. <coughs> Excuse me. Is going to be her funeral? Do you recognize this place? Yeah. This is where my mom... Uh, Dance? This is where I saw her last. Oh. I don't know what all this means, Peter. Oh, she did. But I hope somehow you get your mom back. Only one way to find out. I don't think we should bring it back. If we're given the chance, I, I'm not going to bring it back. I think it'll cause more heartache than anything. What the fuck are you going to do? Just settle down on that? Someone turned up too GG on and on the Wolf Heights. It's not a church. Not a conventional one, anyway. Oh. Sister Prophesized Lady. Looks like it. We just released her. We probably shouldn't have done that. <laughs> that looked so, so painful. Are you okay? Yes. Oh, is it Mantis? Now that you are here. Oh, nice. Not your mom, right? Definitely not. You came for me after all these oh what are these they're very shiny yeah hey over here oh, Peter Quill loud noises you're really here it's been centuries no millennia the name's Star Lord baby hm. oh, I see Star Lord baby <laughs> <laughs> no, no, it's just, it's Star Lord. Legendary outlaw. Why does this never work? You may call me Mantis. Hmm. Whoa! Thank you. Nice, right, baby. May I borrow that? No. <laughs> Your gun. It will only be for a moment. Yeah. That's not gonna happen. <sighs> Very well then. <laughs> wow. 
Didn't see that coming. <sighs> it is so wonderful to be free she of that too. done much anyway. No longer trapped in my own mind. Alone. You are truly the hero the legends foretold. So brave and handsome. Though perhaps not in the classical sense. <laughs> what? You must have many questions for me. Why were you locked in here? So that you could find me. Oh, right. Not okay. very helpful. I have been waiting for you all this time. The moment you touched the forge, I knew you were the celestial one. That you could free me. So I reached out to you the only way I could. Through your memories. The ones most vivid to you. But you must understand, I had no control over them. I... Yes, you should be proud of freeing me. <laughs> I no longer have to stare into the infinite crushing darkness. It was so boring. How could you possibly know how he feels? I can show you, angry lady. <laughs> oh, no. Never mind. May I show you? Sure. Please, I mean no harm. Do it again! Do it again! Come on! With huh. great pleasure! Oh, this isn't going to go well. <laughs> oh. Uh, what emotion was that? I do not believe I should say out loud. Yeah, baby. Sexual. You see, I am an empath. I can read the emotions of others. It is my duty to help the Celestial One decide the fate of the Forge. That could really come in handy. <laughs> oh, she's got to meet the rest of the group. Yeah, introduce an emotionally charged being to a group who are emotionally sensitive. Who <laughs> should we try on first? Nebula. Definitely Drax. I got just the one. Maybe I should have done group. Uh, sorry, Hats. Sorry, baby. <laughs> what is this? Why are her head tentacles glowing? The big green tattoo man is filled with sadness. What? No. He lacks direction. I do not lack direction. Only once have I required a map. Now he is ashamed for his outburst. Mantis uh is an empath, Drax. She can sense your emotions. I do not show emotion! <laughs> She's also the one who made us relive our memories. That was you? We went halfway across the galaxy, got chased by that psycho holla for a party trip? It is my job to guide the Celestial One. What the hell does that mean? Did you choose screw on your play for that? Celestial One? You messed with our minds. Why? She thinks I'm someone called the Celestial One. How about that? Celestial what? Why is there only one? And could that one also be me? Uh, oh, what did he say? I can explain. Feel free to let me know what you said. <laughs> Was it filthy too? Long ago. Wait, wait, wait. Are you going to spew some long mumbo jumbo about where you come from and why I should care? Yes. <laughs> okay, fair enough. <laughs> is that a problem? Remember Thanos? Going on like. Now that I got this, I'm going to roll through the galaxy like a giant turd and blah, blah, blah. Well, I, for one, want to hear it. All of it. Then it's time for a nap. Go ahead, Mantis. Enlighten us. Of course, Star-Lord baby. <laughs> I have communicated only through my feelings for years. It is nice to communicate with my mouth. <laughs> Eons ago. The Eternity Forge coalesced into existence as a way to balance the life energy of the universe. To create, you must destroy. And to destroy, you must create. But such colossal power cannot be wielded oh, yeah, boy, lightly. Boy, 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 boy. So I was brought in to ensure that the Forge was only wielded by someone deserving and to help guide the wielder down the right path. But I waited. 
and waited. Years went by. Many unworthy tried to use the forge. Some even tried to force story, them man. to help them. <laughs> the Cree decided that no culture had matured enough to use the forge with the wisdom required. Eventually, the forge and I were separated. Locked away until the time when civilizations could reach the peak of wisdom and maturity. And that is only the beginning. Well, Yay. thanks a lot for that, Pete. Hmm. What an interesting and relevant story. Yeah. Aren't you glad we heard it all, champ? Someday, Quill, I'm going to blast you out in airlock. I have not yet Bring gotten to the most important part. Kill me. There is a legend of the Celestial One, the Chosen One who shall arrive from the stars to use the Eternity Forge. This Celestial One, what are they like? Advanced intellect, emotionally mature, a wise being capable of navigating the dark waters of immense power. Someone who can Lord. see beyond his own selfish desires. That's... <laughs> that... Describes me pretty perfectly. <laughs> hey, come on, guys. Hey, knock it off. <laughs> it is not funny. Peter is the celestial one. Oh, you're so full of crap, lady. If Pete is this celestial what's it, then why didn't the stupid forge work? Sure, it brought him back. But when we tried to use it again on someone else, it didn't do a damn thing. Your loss. I can feel it has been with you for some time. The forge is limited right now. It can only restore life to a body that is mostly whole and undeteriorated. <sighs> yeah, it's decayed too much. I am Groot. Ah, well, that explains Hala's delightful corpse collection. She'll bring them all back if she gets the forge. Fantastic. So it's incredibly useful to our worst enemy, but useless to us. It can be made more useful. How? The It'll Celestial One time. must deliver the forge to the Sacred Shrine. There you can unlock its true power, or destroy it forever. And that true power is what? Returning anyone, from any time period, back to the realm of the living. Lost Ones. Loved ones, I suppose hated ones too, if you were so inclined. You can bring back anyone? Like, anyone at all? Anyone who ever existed Random can be brought band. back, so long as you have the required energy, of course. Oh, I'm pretty lazy, I don't have much one energy. Life for one life. So someone still has to die for the thing to work. Then let's finish our drinks and go use this thing. Yes! <laughs> really? Who are you planning to kill? Well, you're kind of annoying me right Hala now. Hala wants to use this forge to raise her army. We have to destroy Not it. until my family is returned I to me. Groot. Right? Groot says he's on my side. That's three to one, Gamora. We win. That is not true. Groot feels the opposite. Uh, mm -hmm. I mean, maybe something got lost in translation. Hey, hey, you try understanding I am Groot all the time. You mistranslated Groot. On purpose. How long have you been doing this? I just slipped up. If <laughs> this was a one-time thing. I am Groot? Okay, a two-time thing. So, it is a tie then. Two for using it. I am Groot. I'm gonna take a guess. He said two for destroying it. Don't you get what this means? We can bring back anyone that we lost. Right now, I'm... I'm thinking we destroy it. Yep. Paula can't Snake get her it. hands on this again. If she does, we're gonna all be speaking Cree. We're dead. <laughs> well, one way or another, this all ends got at the shrine. Just fly somewhere else. Can you take us there, Mantis? I have never been, but with your help, I believe I can sense its location. May we have some space to concentrate? Gladly. If anyone needs me, I'll be emotionally unavailable. And that's new. Ha ha ha. What are you doing? Helping? Uh-huh. Hmm. Maybe it is best if you sit still. Right, of course. <sighs> I can't.
cannot sense the shrine. There is so much unrest among your crew. Their emotions are overwhelming me. They look to you for guidance. Help them. Okay. Provide help. Come. Drax. How are you doing? I don't know, man. We should I am. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> Shut up. We're not weak. <laughs> the forge can bring my family back. Yet you consider destroying it. Mm -hmm. Well, I. You are our leader. And it is your decision. Here, we're going to destroy it. So I must trust you would not take away my chance to reunite with my wife and daughter. Uh -huh. I'm probably you know, you did not trust me to guard Nebula. Well, that. And you did not behave in a trustworthy manner just now. But I hope your shot was good, by the way, sir. <laughs> You had no right to have the antenna woman do that to me. You did not even ask my permission. Hey, hey, but calm down. It was just a joke. No harm meant by it. I do not like what you call a joke. She right. told me I was afraid. Calm down. I do not like to feel afraid. Such feelings bring me great shame. You should be ashamed. But talking warrior. to you, a frequently scared person, has helped. Yeah. Anytime, Drax. Hey. How about with three? Hey there, Groot. Oh. Is that a friend of yours? Mm. Groot. I'll tell you this. We're all gonna be okay. No matter what happens with the forge. I am Groot. Alright. Cool, cool. Hey. Hey, bud, what's up? Well, if it ain't Captain Indecision. What are you. I, know I'm not I, doing. I don't know what's holding you back from doing the right thing here, Quill. I mean, I can count on one paw how many folks ever get a chance to bring back someone they love. Yeah, move on. I am Groot. And what happens if Hala gets a hold of it, huh? This falls into the wrong hands, the whole galaxy is screwed. The whole galaxy is already screwed. It's always screwed. It'll be double screwed. It'll you be think helix. if we destroy this thing, that'll make a difference? Nah. The only ones you're screwing are your so-called friends. Rocket. No, oh, he went. You there. know what, Pete? I wish the Forge had never brought you back. Yeah. Savage. I am Groot. This should have brought someone else. Anyone I'm going to go deep on this. I'm going to go deep on this. Lila would be ashamed of you right now. You Get saw em. one damn memory of her. You're talking like you knew her? Go to hell, Pete. Only this time, don't come back. I am Groot. Right. You can both go to hell. But that went well. well. That's one way to clear his emotional unrest. I am Groot. Don't worry, buddy. I know. Now that one wasn't really a thumb up one. It wasn't really worth a thumb up. Fine. Fine. You can use the toilet Fine. first. <laughs> Fine. Hey, are you okay? The hell was that? I tried to say everything I could think of. I thought maybe if I asked her to stick around for a while, Ugh. she won't hear it. Not from me. She'll barely even look at me. So don't give up on her. Family is always worth it. I know. I'm really trying. I don't know. What's your family like? I, I West just Bar can't Baptist find Church? the right yeah, words with her. Man, some family. Maybe, maybe if we had more time, I could try talking to oh, her. Oh, family from Texas Chainsaw Massacre. Oh no, they looked after each other. Give yeah. her some space, without losing her altogether. Well, they say time heals all wounds. Who's they? Everyone. I have no idea. Maybe I can get her to hang around. 
I'm demolishing this popcorn. It's too maybe good. Maybe not right now. <laughs> I think she needs some alone time. You all right? Any luck yet? I'm afraid not. Someone here remains very unsettled emotionally. Oh. Nebula? Oh, Peter. Maybe it's Peter. Hey, Neb Neb. Um. Hey, Nebula. Yeah, uh, hey, it's me, <laughs> Peter Quill, but, uh, <laughs> yeah, but you know that. Mind if I sit? Cool, yeah, this is, uh, this is really, how's the arm? That's for not letting me fight the Kree. Sorry, Nebula, but it's what seemed right at the time. Yeah. You have a pretty flexible idea of what's right. Just like my sister. Yeah, Speaking well, of my dear like sister, that you got an earful. What'd she say about me? That I'm a waste of space. That I deserve everything I've been through. She says that you won't talk to her. She's really broken up about how you two fell apart. <laughs> well, that's pretty much all thanks to her. I, mean, I bet she forgot to mention how she pack. ruined our family. How she destroyed my life. Yeah, well, that's not how it looked to me. What do you mean? When we were in the temple, I saw Gamora's memory of your last mission. Oh, yeah? Memories aren't always see? reliable, right? <laughs> well, for one, you've got a pretty screwed up definition of family. Two sisters being forced to fight each other and kill people, that doesn't sound like a family to me. It was to me. You have no idea what really happened that day. And neither does Gamora. Not all of it, at least. Then tell us. Then you make show a good me. story. Oh. Now, please take my hand. If this kills me, I'm going to kick your ass. There. Oh. I mean, popcorn. Jesus, Mantis. She has no consideration. Is everything all right? What's going on? Thanos mm -hmm. wants to talk to you. To me? Oh. Just a little extra salt the Nebula, my favorite daughter. Oh, Father. Your attacks far. against your sister were swift, precise. You disarmed Gamora easily. I was impressed. Gamora is a good teacher. I owe all my knowledge to her. And yet you emerged the victor. You Did have she? clearly outgrown her teachings. There is something you must know about Gamora. She said she, she would city. not disappoint me. But I am not so sure. Every day she grows more agitated and bitter as she watches you surpass her. You've seen her lack of respect. She disobeys me time and time again. I no longer trust her. You shouldn't trust her either, Nebula. Gamora has become a risk to our family. You can trust me, father. No matter what. I know you will never disappoint me, Nebula. I caution you to be careful with Anna your sister. Fiddle. That is all I ask. If she continues to be a problem, you might take her place. Stand by my side as my greatest warrior and only daughter. Gamora makes it? herself more useless, more unreliable with each passing day. It won't come to that, Father. 
I'm not so certain. We shall see how things go on Phalian. Yeah. This is your moment. Go and prepare. Stab your sister in Keep the back. Keep your communications open. Ooh. I'll be monitoring the situation. Gun high. Oof. Just a bunger. Are you all right? Are you hurt? Why? She was about to finish. Life. Why did you do that? What? Both probably have I had him. Memories. That was my kill, and you took it from me. Tarval was about to kill you, Nebula. I just saved your life. I know you want to impress Thanos, but trust me, he is not worth dying over. Nebula. Father. You were wrong. It has come to this after all. Oof. I am done with her insolence. If you don't get rid of her, I will do it myself. Only I will ensure that your sister suffers greatly. Give me the Thanos device. Is a terrible father. Nebula, what are you doing? You took my kill. Give me the device in exchange. Give it to me. Now! I'm not asking here. No, that's not how this works. I don't take orders from you. Ching. Then you leave me no choice. What are you? <sighs> Bad sister of the year award goes to Nebula. Before she fell off the edge. Oh, okay, there we go. Is it done? What's going on? Mm. I mean, she still definitely stepped in. But... What are you making him see? <coughs> it wasn't over. She showed me your last mission together. I was trying to show him what really happened with Tarval. But of course, you interrupted us. I'm sorry. Again. I... I didn't know what was going on. And as usual, you didn't bother to find out until you'd ruined it. Oh, yeah. Because if I'd known you were watching yourself kill me again, I would have been fine with that. Hey. She was always pushing against Thanos, testing his limits. What happened was her fault. Yeah. I practically shoved that knife into my own back. Too bad I had such terrible aim. Some assassin. Gamora, I wasn't trying to kill you. Just pierce oh, yeah? your entire body. Then what were you doing? Nicely. Because it looked exactly like you were trying to kill me. Thanos said if she didn't do it, he'd do it himself. Only he'd make you suffer. Instead, I ended up suffering. I see. Yeah, she got like a robot. Admit head now. it. You just wanted to prove you were better than me by killing. If I wanted to kill you, you'd be dead. Thanos was going to kill you himself. There would have been nothing left of you. Do you know? I even checked your pulse just to make sure you were still alive. You never got to see that part. The most important part, but I did. That doesn't make any sense. I'm kind of believing her here, Gamora. If she hadn't fake killed you, I'm pretty sure Thanos would have been a lot more thorough. Yeah. It's possible. Still a bad sister, though. She could have just let go. I don't know what to believe. Could have just told her. Well, I'm I guess just Thanos trying to keep us she together. Could have it down. You're my family. That family ended a long time ago. Uh, I'm the one who got stabbed here. Oh, as usual, it's about you. Nebula, look, I don't know you, like, super well, even though I've seen, well, more than I'd like to of your life. But, man, you obviously 
cared about Gamora. And I think you still do. So, the voice actors please, I've got for these characters are pretty good, to sister, be fair. <clears throat> give me a chance. Look into her yellow panda eyes. You can't see that. Aww. GG, Peter. GG. Peter, I can finally sense the shrine. Yeah. Okay. Let's go. isn't my favorite assassin sisters. <laughs> well, that'd be a pretty rad band name. Hey, Peter. Hmm. Give me one second. I'll meet you in my room. Sure. Quill. Mm, coffee. <laughs> Thank you for I've never been a fan of coffee that. myself. I've tried lots of different coffees. A lot to there's always that person who's always like, gives Let me you should try hope. this coffee. Let me make you a coffee. Uh, you'll what you will like you? it. And I'm like, it's not nice. It's coffee. Huh. Yeah. I'm glad you do it. I enjoy my tea. More than Not I should, that. so I get you how you feel. <laughs> uh, hey, Pete. Uh, I threw some mean words your way back there, and I, uh, I just I wanted to apologize, you know. Good, you little shit. So yeah, sorry about that. Hey, don't even worry about it, man. Best friends forever? No. Yeah, at least until death. It's close enough. Yeah, true. Hey, Leon. How you doing, dude? You got yourself coffee too? Or you just love yourself some coffee too? How you doing today, man? <laughs> I can tell Aww. these sounds bring you supreme joy! And also such Aww. sadness. You are a very nostalgic person. <laughs> <laughs> GG Peter. Hey, hey, whoa, what's the matter? Why, why are you crying? Why am I crying? Oh god. That little box. Oh, it brings you so much sorrow. <laughs> Drax is so disappointed. I'm sorry for that. Sometimes emotions overwhelm me and Reflect back onto others. Yeah, that's cool. <clears throat> I'm cool. I'm cool. Okay. Everyone on this ship is so poisoned by their feelings. What just happened? Oh, she like she could tell because <clears throat> he likes his music, but always makes him sad for his mum. Um, experiencing all the wonderful things around you. Um, so he's well, both happy to hear the music, but also sad because he thinks of his mum. Hard to let go and of And she was past. like, she couldn't take it. Because she's an empath, so she feels all of the emotions. That. But because she's an empath, she can also push emotion back onto people. So he got all booby-eyed. Look, have you been in the internet the coffee of coffee, of coffee factory? Damn. Well, that will get you onto coffee, I'm sure. <laughs> Thank you for letting me listen to your music. Oh, it, it wasn't for free. It made me feel better. And worse Money, at the same time. Come on, Mantis. Come I loved on. it. <laughs> it's rental service. Check codex. Oh yeah, we should check because um, <coughs> people email us and shit. So we don't really need to read the codexes, but we do need to read any messages we've got. So we've got some from people. Okay, shit, we've got a few. Okay, so Cosmo has messaged us again. Oh no, wait, we've read that one every time. I swear it always says that one's unread, but it isn't. Um, yeah, we've read that one as well. Okay, I've read that one as well. Um, yep, I remember that one. I remember that one. I think I read that one. Hello, Peter Quill. I am increasing my worth by training to become a technical warrior. From this point forward, you will be able to communicate with me without the use of your vocal cords. Drags to destroyer. P.S. Drags he didn't know to hit send. Oh, that's Rocket. Why is Rocket doing Drax's voice? What a weirdo. Peter! 
I had to play it with the mess you cool left over my safe house. Dead levers and fair boy. You know my ravages guy, just your fair particular do. This is the final time I stick my crap for you. Talk Mundo, I'm very available. Oh. Um so, so, uh, crisis, but after behaviour today. Oh yeah, because we injured a lot of their peoples. Oh, please do not contact me at Quill for all forty four. Oh, he had his email address as, as ours. Well, don't be like that. And by that, do you mean somebody reports me to high ups? Blah blah blah. blah. But I'm sorry to say, but your ship stole your prize. Still bugs. We're sorry. You've reached an inactive account. Oh. Peter found myself in a bit of a windfall, and things are looking up. Uh, for once, I'm paying my ravages, and there's even enough re up poster my captains. Oh, enough to reposter my captaincy. <laughs> I think we had our disagreements, and I want to invite you, especially Gimonda, to Rajak for a meal of your life. Bring what you like to drink. P.S. I don't watch your critters and redros near, near the good eats. I don't want your critters and weirdos near the good eats. You and Gimonda only. Jesus Christ. <laughs> hey, welcome back, Eric, dude. Damn. How long have we been streaming? You did a whole school session? <laughs> What gives Star Lord? What gives Star Lord? You are famous and suddenly you're too big, bro. Howie, wah! Why you wah? I think we need to have a man to dog talk and catch up. I'm not half the trouble Rocket is, and I got special skills too. You know, I got keen intellect and mostly full flask. And I'm trained in a deadly art of quack fool. Just know that I got your back, so don't be afraid to give me a jingle if you need a backup. In all honesty, things aren't going too well with Bev, and I can use the time my own. Wah! Out the duck. Little bitch. Okay. Hey, Mantis. Now we can fly. Can you direct me to that magic shrine thing now? Of course. But it is a long way, and I must concentrate completely. There can be no. There can be no distraction. I didn't know it would do that. <laughs> oh, you have made us all Distractions. Huh. See what I can do. It's only now in 15 minute class. Nice. Cool. That's the good thing when you get into like higher education.
The entrance to the shrine. were not only skilled warriors, you can find great symbolism in much of their architecture. Yeah, yeah, they like pretty things. We get it. Now what, Pete? Mantis? Any pointers? It appears that the forge goes there, on the altar. And away we go. Uh, magic. Seriously? Well, that was anticlimactic. There we go. It's oh, you've got to give it time to wake up. Find anything that looks off. Mm, I am it's gonna be the reflection. Of course something's wrong. Because we're in a freaking creed temple where everything is anything? always more complicated than it needs to be. I mean, ain't they ever heard of an on switch? Has grown quiet. How do you know I'll make the right choice about the forge? I do not know that. Oh. You are the wielder of the Eternity Forge. It chose you. Yes. You must trust there's a reason. Yeah, okay. No pressure at all. So, what now? Repair the statues. Determine the fate of the universe. Oh, is that all? Simple instructions. <laughs> Cool, okay. We'll fix all the statues in a minute. We're going to talk to everybody first. Well, we're about to seal the fate of the Eternity Forge. Yes. Your decision will leave you despised by much of the team. <laughs> Good pep talk. Thanks, Drax. No matter what you choose. Yep, you can stop now. Mm -hmm. No matter what I decide about the Eternity Forge, you've got my back, right? I am Groot. Is that a yes? Or a no? <laughs> I am Groot. How you holding up, buddy? I am Groot. Okay, yeah, well, good. don't get your hopes up. He could still do the right thing and decide not to destroy the most useful artifact in the universe. Okay, well that's where Rocket Raccoon is. Let's see where Gamora and Nebneb is. Do, 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 do. I forgot you could walk faster. <laughs> so, uh, are you glad you stayed with Gamora? Yes. Yeah, I think yeah, we made the right staying decision. close to my sister is what's best for both of us. I hope so. Because otherwise I'm pretty sure I'm going to get the blame. Oh, how's the Waffle Heist going down? Oh, I'm in taking all of them again. Beautiful. He does not like to share those. Uh, uh, uh. <laughs> Ooh, 
walking around the temple because I don't know where Gamora is. She might be up in the clouds, no, she's over here. Let's see what her business is. Can I not talk to her? Hey, Gam Gam. Oh, this one's going to be a hard one to fix, hey? So, I'm not allowed to speak to her. Am I not allowed to go up in this section? Okay, so we're going to go talk with Rocket first. He's around here somewhere. Let's screw it up. Okay, Rocket's over here. What is the high stuff? Ah, Leon. That's the way to um, do a little bit of like a little extra sort of fun and mini games and stuff. So, if uh, in the chat, if you ever see that come up, waffle heists are a way that you can gamble some of your money to try and win some more fizz bucks back, um, and it helps you get into like the top ten and stuff. So, the top ten, they're the people that have killed it at waffle heists. Um, yeah, you can do many things. You can do waffle heists. You can do fizzle fights once you have enough points. You can you want mates. And but if you ever need a look on what we need to do, always feel free to do exclamation mark help. Yeah, and always feel free to ask me for further information as well. <laughs> Once we get all these statues working, are you ready for whatever happens next? That depends on you, Pete. You know how much bringing Lila back means to me. Ain't gonna happen. And only you can make that happen. Well, it ain't gonna happen then. I've just told you that. Get over it. Gosh. Okay, let's do some repairing. Masonry 101. Let's go. Yep. Doing a great job. Okay, so that one's working. This one isn't. Two thousand hours, fucking well done, nine and baby. GG, dude. I think you are the first to hit two thousand hours. God damn, that's amazing. Cheers, man. Thanks for being around so long. <laughs> you just want you? Oh, yeah. You'll soon. You'll soon get the hang of it after watching a couple. I'll assure you. <laughs> okay, there we go. go. <laughs> no, you were saying. Rocket, tell Groot I need some help with the lens thing. Okay, okay. Yeah, Leon, Mario. if you do exclamation mark FB like Eric has, it will show you how many fizz bucks you have. So you can sort of then choose how much you want to like um, risk in Waffle Heist and that. Hmm. Nice. Yeah, Groot. Go help Pete destroy this totally awesome thing that could make all our lives better. I am Groot. Thanks, Groot. He says he wants me to be happy, but that this isn't about me. What? Is that really what he said? One more to go. Something tells me it's not going to be easy. Yes, yeah, break. So I'm breaking. Last one, the one that Nebula's on? Can't remember. I think Neb not Nebula, sorry, Gamora. I think she's at the final one. Yeah. Okay, let's see. This big guy used to stand here holding up that giant whatever it is thingy. When things go bad, age sets in. 
Oh no, I dropped it. Ah. <laughs> so where did it go? Gonna talk to Gam Gam first. How's it going, Gamora? <clears throat> okay. Good talk. In a few minutes, we're gonna have to decide the fate of the Eternity Forge. Not we. You. For whatever reason, this is all in your hands. Very responsible, it's fine. Look, I know you haven't really sided with me or taken any of my advice lately, but the forge is dangerous. You have to make sure oh. no one can use it. That's Ever. my intention, at least. I want to destroy it. that just being theatrical <clears throat> excuse me what now celestial one it's good Jet boots overheating. Maybe we need someone of Drax's strength. Shame. Drax, I need <laughs> your muscles. You cannot have them. They are attached to me. No, I know they. Uh, I need your help. <laughs> I've got to lift something very heavy. Ah, I see. You are weak. I will help you. I am ready. to death ain't on my list of to-dos, Pete. I'm sure if you just reach really hard, you, you could get it. Please, Rocket, I need you. Ah, all right. Yeah, we got him. But I get smushed. You better use that damn forge to bring me back. No destroying it. That's fair. We'll bring back an M-Destroyer. Still no statue upon which to set it. I would have gotten the lens, guys. I was just, you know, working up to it. <laughs> sure. Yep. We just gotta, you know, work together. Oh, you mean like a team? What a novel idea. Yes, teamwork often brings good feelings. Yeah. Perhaps we are doing it wrong then. Huh. Okay, listen up. I need everyone over here. Nope, not gonna happen. Just a little higher! My arms can't go any higher! My muscles are soft. Hmm. Shut up. Guys, stop talking! Like a baby's bottom. Shut up! No! That's my face! A very fat baby. Sorry. <laughs> hey, what do I know about whatever you are, anatomy? <laughs> Idiots. Maybe your people enjoy having their faces stepped on. Here we go. It's done. That mean I can drop this thing? No. Oh, oh god damn, that's been painful. These freaking temples. I'm gonna take dynamite to all of them. 
Now it is truly time to decide. We're definitely destroying it. <laughs> No good Turn can come from bringing the, the zombie people back. Forever. Turn the forge to the right to empower it and bring it to its full potential. Gonna press left. Okay. Wait, his right or your right? Oh. Hmm. I don't know. What? what? <laughs> Let me see. Wow. I can't believe that almost happened. <laughs> Turn it this way to destroy it. Turn it this Yeah, we got it. Turn it to the right, Pete. It's left, Peter. You want your left. Peter, you must turn it left. No! It's right to empower you, idiot! I'm sorry. But this thing is way too powerful for anyone to wield. We gotta destroy it. Thank you, Get Peter. Right Work it. There's two more episodes up. I wonder if they're like, no, GG, you did it. I don't need to anticipate the rest of it. Don't let go. Rocket, I know you're upset. You don't know anything about me, lady. Perhaps she has never lost a loved one. She has only killed the loved ones of others. Drax! You'll get you him. don't talk like that to my sister. I will no. talk to Gamora what in whatever star? manner I please, what robot. Star? I am Groot. Oh yeah, and what it's would you know about it? You're a freaking piece of wood. The process has begun. You can release it. You can't even communicate on your own. Think I like translating for you every single I time? I am Groot. And now you're gonna start. Drax, back me up. You are all. People. No offense, Drax, but mm. wisdom isn't your strong suit either. Guys, we got company. <coughs> Thank you, Peter Quill. When you started it, it's too late. I never could have found this shrine without you. You're welcome. And the tracking device jeans are placed on your ship. Speaking of you know, <laughs> I didn't think you could get more annoying than that time you killed me. <laughs> you really suck. Their usefulness has expired. Dispose of them. Fight uh -oh. Sonia, let's go. Oh, they're so. Wait, were they going to sacrifice Not themselves again. anyway? God, I have friggin' hate that thing. Oh, I've had about enough of this. Is Boots working again now? God, <laughs> much more busted than I thought. How you like me now, huh? <laughs> huh? Oh, no, 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 you no. probably shouldn't have so high. Of oh. course, oh. you silly bugger. Perish to the depths, blue demon. He knows he can just let go, right? Well, once he holds it, it's, uh, it's out of play. Oh, savage. One box. <laughs> well, ain't that something? <laughs> Stop! They're on it! Big blue lady. Not the first time. <laughs> oh, shit. Go 
on Rocket. I'm not sure what you're aiming to do. Maybe just take control Intriguing. of it. Intriguing. Yeah, get some boy. You let me have a minute. <laughs> Sheesh. Now, where was I? Well, that was surprisingly easy. Hang on, buddy. I got you. Yeah, it's some. Oh. Wow. <gasps> <laughs> Oh, okay. It's ah, silly crap. Crap. Go on, Brick. I am Brute! It's not like I did it on purpose. Things got a bit of a learning curve. I'm sorry to have made you sad. We should do this more often. Looks like the boys could use some help. This won't be easy. Hope not. Face shot right with the sword. It's usually pretty deadly. I got it. Hmm. Should have got this last head of my man. Rocket had the right idea. <laughs> Just on her, she'll be fine. The Eternity Forge is mine. Power, stop! Valdi, my son. Why don't we come try and fight her? We've we already turned it the other way. It's broken. Ah, oh, yeah. Ooh, she said a mouthful there, buddy. Oh, oh, you just destroyed his soul. You silly, you silly no. lady. I'm going back to the Savage. Wrecked. That's what you get. We turn it to, to be destroyed. You should have then chose something else to be manifested at that time. Silly lady. Fuck, she go. Or did she just sacrifice herself so he could come back? It's done. The Eternity Forge is no more. I mean, it does exist, it's just a bit scattered. Hope you're happy, Quill. Doesn't look You did too what happy. needed to be done. Yeah. Yeah, I guess so. Yeah, exactly. Now everyone can share. Everyone can have a piece each. Oh. Uh oh. She's gonna be a little angry. You do everything Ooh. from me. Maybe a little power infested? I will destroy you. And all that 
Oh, she all freaky and shit now. That's, uh... That's not great. <laughs> she has definitely awoken, and she did not want to be awoken. That's an angry morning person. Right there. Episode 3. More than a feeling. Although that song wasn't played... In fact, none of the songs that have been put as the title song have been played in this. Okay. Fighting a bully. You and 80.4% of players used your words against a bully. Like you promised your Marja you would do. Training Nebula. You and 46.2% of players defeated Nebula. Shit. Most people lost to Nebula. <laughs> Fucking get wrecked, nerd. Jesus, she was easy. Oh, wait. It took me back to that one. She's a zombie now. I think she is. Yeah, she looks crazy. Assassin Sisters. You and 94.3% of players convinced Gamora to make up with Nebula. Damn. Cyborg on board. You and 94% of players decided Nebula should stay. Aww. Should have probably turned up in that scene anyway. And the Fate of the Forge. You and 62% of players chose to destroy the Eternity Forge. Okay. Makes sense. Okay. Next time on The Walking Sir Dead. Is tagging along, but she's only creating more questions than answers. About the Eternity Forge, about Hala, about everything. Janitors of the galaxy. That's what we should be called. And Hala and the Kree, well, they're just the latest cosmic spill. As much as he's wrong about almost everything he does, Peter was justified in his actions with the Forge. Mm -hmm. She agreed with me? I mean, <laughs> of course she did. Can I get a copy of her saying that? I mean, who is recording this? It's what happened next that he should regret. Next time on the real life. Stop trying to make me buy the goddamn movie. I've seen it. I have it. Fuck off.